As infrastructure ages in this country, especially the original clay tile sewer systems from 100 years ago or more, infiltration and inflow becomes a problem with many communities. America's infrastructure is failing and has a, a, a huge uh, financial need. EPA has estimated greater than $80 million. Underground and out of sight, sewer lines tend to be forgotten. Over time, traditional sewer systems develop cracks and deficiencies. During wet weather and high volume storm events, water enters the sanitary sewer system through leaking joints and structural defects and can quickly fill the system beyond capacity. Extraneous flow can spill onto streets and discharge into lakes and rivers, creating public health risks and contaminating the environment. We're a small city of about 15,000 people and had an extensive I, &I problem and we evaluated some different types of systems, replacing the gravity sewer system, low pressure force mains, and a step system. After evaluating the costs that were required and how intrusive we would be on the community, we chose the low pressure force main. E1's low pressure sewer system consists of a network of small diameter pressure pipes and grinder pumps installed at each residence or business. The grinder pump station collects the wastewater, grinds the solids into small particles, and conveys it to a larger sewer main or directly to a wastewater treatment plant. The pressure-tight system virtually eliminates extraneous flows. This has profound effects on treatment plant capacity, cost, and performance. Over the last five years, we've evaluated the cost that we've saved at the treatment plant, and it appears that we've reduced the amount of flow to the plant by about 27 million gallons per year. That turns into $70,000 per year savings. With the E1 system, I&I &I can typically be reduced to virtually 0% compared to traditional solutions that may achieve 30% reduction. The low pressure sewer system uses two to four inch force mains that follow the contour of the land and are installed just below the frost line, eliminating the need for large, deep trenches. These small trenches can equal huge savings. The construction savings for low pressure sewer versus gravity sewer is approximately 20%. And shallow trenches mean less disruption to the community and minimal environmental impact. The low pressure force main was a great opportunity to stay away from the water table and not have to worry about the inflow and infiltration any longer. Low pressure sewer systems are gaining acceptance as a viable and cost effective alternative for both remediation and replacement of gravity collection sewers. When any of our clients are considering low pressure sewer system with individual grinder pumps, we always recommend Environment One as the pump of choice for their individual applications. The reliability of the equipment, the responsiveness of the company, and the innovator of the grinder pump technology over 40 years ago is what leads us to make that recommendation to our client. The E1 Sewer, a viable alternative to eliminate infiltration and inflow.